A fatal accident occurred at the James F. Conahan Transportation Center this morning. According to witness accounts, an elderly man with a cane was walking behind a bus and the driver of that Luzerne County Transportation Authority bus was backing out. She hit the man and ran over him. Stanley Strelish, executive director for the LCTA, said that a thorough investigation will be done in cooperation with the Wilkes-Barre City Police Department. Strelish said it's a tough day and he also added that it's very, very sad. Strelish said there were sufficient rules in place, but the LCTA will be taking a look at other rules and safety guidelines in the future. Two witnesses described what they saw. My name is Jean Rapjack. I live in Nanny Cove and I ride the buses all the time. Yeah, so... Uh, Have you ever seen anything like this before? I saw that man first coming from in back of the bus. And he stood in back of the bus for a while. He was a bad with a cane, an older man. And then he started to walk again, walk again, walk again, walk again. And I said, Mr. Yvette, to myself, you better hurry and get out of there because she's going to back up the bus. And that's when she backed up the bus. And I said, oh, I'm sorry. And he was walking. He was walking slow. She's backing up the bus. And he's going like this. I guess maybe he felt the pressure. And all of a sudden, she hit him. She hit him. And then, and then some lady ran to, to where the bus was. The bus driver, she said, stop, don't back anymore, don't back anymore. But it was too late. He was hit. So that's all. I saw him. But I, but, I, but I said to myself, that man should never have walked in back of the bus. And I don't think she wouldn't be able to see him, I guess, with the, with the, because he was like the middle of the bus. Oh my God. But that, when he first got to the bus, he just stood there in back of the bus, you know? Maybe he was tired or something, you know? And then, then he start walking. And that's when she started to back the bus. And, oh, well, when that lady ran to the door and told her to stop, 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 she said, she must have said to, the, to Donna, stop, 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 there's a, there's a man in back of the bus. And, and you, know, you hit him. And then Donna got off the bus and she looked to me like she was, oh, she looked, oh, she looked like, oh, she was like this and everything. She was so, I felt so sorry for her. I felt sorry for the man, but I felt sorry for her too. Yeah, Harry Godleski, I'm from Hanover Township. And that's where I catch the bus at Hanover Township. But then I take it sometimes down towards Anacoke and stuff too, so. Well, we got off the bus. I saw this old guy with a cane over there by that light. And he was just standing there. She got back on the bus, shut the door. She started honking the horn, looking in the mirrors. Next thing started going, then he stopped, then he started going again, and she hit him. He rolled under it, tires went on top of him. By fact, it took like uh, 30 rings to get 911 answer. And when I, and then I tried, I went around the bus to see, I looked under the bus to see if I could get some kind of response. I got no response from him. He was bleeding from the head at the time, but his legs were still trapped under the wheels. So I think she did everything she possibly normally could. You know, she did honk, keep honking the horn, looking in her mirrors. You know, it's just a tragic accident. But, but so I, she didn't know he was. She had him. no clue, no, because this guy was over there at first, and he could see the bus pulling out. I mean, if you can't see that bus or hear it, you shouldn't be walking along. You know, so but she's a wreck right now. I talked her out, but she's a wreck. She's upset. Really bad. I should have told one of the ambulance drivers to give her a set of them. That's how bad she is. I think today was her Friday. She was going to park that bus and go home. That's what happened. Do you know the bus driver well? I mean, do you ride that bus? Yeah, well? I ride the bus. I, I know her real well. Yeah. She's always problems? been a good bus driver. I've never heard of her having any problems. I mean, she drives that bus three times a week. I'm always on it. She used to drive it every day on a certain time, you know. But the 14 drivers, I usually know because I take the 14 every day.